What is up guys, Mr. The Reverts here, welcome back to the channel. Today I want to show you guys a couple of things that may pique your interest for this coming weekend. And starting today at 10 a.m. Pacific time is double XP for both multiplayer and zombies, and then double merits for Blackout Battle Royale. Again, this is starting on March 29th today at 10 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. Kind of wish we could have got double tiers for this weekend, but the double XP and merits are greatly appreciated as always. Now, yesterday, a lot of players were getting this Blackout After Dark playlist whenever they would search up a game mode to play. And as you can see in the image, the playlist has a lock, meaning you can't access or play the game mode. And a lot of people are thinking that maybe this is a new game mode where the Blackout map has like a nighttime theme behind it. Because we did see in Operation Grand Heist that uh, there is definitely going to be a darkened version or a theme going on in the Blackout map. And again, this is in the trailer for the Operation, um, but we have yet to see that as of now. I do think it's going to be coming very, very soon here, possibly sooner than we may expect. And one of the things I noticed, which is very inconspicuous in the Blackout map, are these light poles. Heck, there's a whole bunch of them literally scattered throughout the entire map. And pretty much every location has some variation of a light fixture or like some type of an object that could possibly be a luminous object. And I'm going to be flying around the Blackout map, showing you guys the ones that I was able to find. And so yeah, as you can see throughout the streets, we can find at least one of these objects. Now, I don't think that any of these were added into the game and we all just happen to notice them right now. But what I think what happened is Treyarch had planned to add a nighttime theme to Blackout from the very, very start. I'm going to go back and look at some old footage of gameplay I have recorded and see if there's, you know, any of these light poles that weren't there before. But like I said, I'm pretty sure they've all been there from the very, very start. And I do believe that Treyarch had planned to add a nighttime theme to Blackout. Um, but what I think this playlist could be is something for the pro players to use whenever there is a blackout tournament going on, which leads me into the next segment of the video is a blackout after dark tournament happening, which is today at 3 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. And this is going to be going out for all of the COD World League players. Um, there's also going to be some special guests, but they haven't listed those names yet. And they're all going to be playing for $20,000, which is a lot of money to play for for a Battle Royale game. Um, it's all going to be streamed on Twitch too. I'm going to have a link down below in the description for you guys. Um, so yeah, like I said, the prize pool is very, very huge. And you can watch it all on Twitch. I do think this playlist is for those pro, those pro players to, uh, to get into. And, and it can track their stats better, their wins, that kind of stuff. I don't think it's anything um, for us regular players at all. Um, maybe this was like a glitch that happened over on the dev side and they accidentally made this go live or it just glitched out and everybody was able to see this or something. I don't know. Either way though, I'm pretty sure it doesn't have any relation to us regular players whatsoever. Unless maybe the playlist would randomly match us up with one of the players or teams competing in the event and then we can like spectate them or something. I think that would be pretty dang cool. Um, but yeah, those are my theories on the game mode. Nothing has been said from Activision or Treyarch, so do keep that in mind. And then finally, if you guys didn't know, Black Ops 4 and Twitch Prime has partnered up together, kind of like last year for Call of Duty World War II, where if you were a Twitch Prime member, then you can earn exclusive in-game items for free every single month. You don't have to spend COD points to get these items or anything. You just have to be a Twitch Prime member. And I'm going to have a link down below in the description in case you guys want to sign up and claim rewards. For this month, players are going to be getting a digital purple camo for all the specialist characters. And then a purple theme camo for your guns. And then the party chat jump pack, which has a bunch of these specialist characters as emoji faces, which I think is pretty dang cool. And again, the links are going to be down below in case you want to sign up for Twitch Prime. Or you can use the free 30-day trial period if you guys want to do that and get the items instead. You can just cancel your membership and get your money back. Also, again, every single month, there's going to be new items for Twitch Prime members to get. And that's going to wrap it up for today's video. If you guys did enjoy, don't forget to leave a like down below and comment your thoughts what you think the Blackout playlist after dark could possibly be. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, I'll see you all later.
dog my can in the tree. What you doing? Um, yeah. Is this shit a little long? 